What's up, operators? This is Jet. This is Fox. <coughs> this is day two of American Mill Sim Operation Broken Home 2. I've been in the game for about an hour and a half now. I'm completely behind enemy lines. I snuck into a church building earlier. Uh, overheard a conversation from a bunch of, from about 10 to 15 guys. Uh, while I hid under the rampway, I uh, just hit, just did kind of a hit and run on the front line. I'm just kind of hiding out right now, hoping they'll find me, trying to catch my breath. All right, operators, just a heads up the commentary will jump back and forth between myself in game and in the after action commentary, which you're hearing right now. So, right now I have moved up to the front line, which is south of Pegasus Bridge. What I'm doing right here is I'm checking to make sure this respawn point is still under our control. Earlier when I snuck into the bridge area, I turned the flag over to our corresponding team's flag, so that way it would become a respawn point for our side. Unfortunately, I'm like the only person on my team in this area, so it's basically just my own little personal respawn point, if I need it. You can see some red rags there through the trees of enemy dead players. Unfortunately for them, I've turned the flag over so they've got a long ways to walk before they can respawn. Hey, hey, hey I just I took this shit. Dude. Yo. What? Yo, you wanna go to the helicopter with me? I already did, hang on. I'm trying to protect this fucking spawn point. Uh yeah, hold on. Well, I already went on my chopper gunner thing. I know, but just get this on camera. What's going on right now is Tom wants me to go on a helicopter gun run with him so he can film it. But I've already done the helicopter gun run, and I really don't want to give up this respawn point in case our team pushes through to Pegasus Bridge. <laughs> Yeah, I trip over that branch in front of me. I hit two tan enemies, another tan guy runs out from me seemingly nowhere grabs his buddy to medic him and a whole bunch of them turn around and start shooting at me so now it's time for me to get the heck out of here now after laying low for a while I decide it's time to make another attack on the front line but I decide to attack from a different side of the trail now Make my way over to these concrete bunkers so that way I can have a little a lot of cover, good solid cover and not just trees. And from this position it seems like I'll have good concealment too since all the trees around me make this area very dark. Right there, that is the blob of tan guys all huddled behind this little hut, and I am just raining BBs down on them. After hitting those three tan guys behind that hut, I decided to move up a little bit because now a lot of the enemies are just out of range. So I'm going to move into these bushes right here and start shooting from a concealed area. These shadows are concealing me so well that the tan guys think they're getting shot in the back by their own teammates. Hey. I'm not tan! Hey. Thank you! Nope! I've already stepped out from cover and concealment and yelled to these guys that I'm not tan, but they still don't believe me. I'm not tan! Stop. 
peel the out. Oh. As I'm running away from the guys at the front, I spot more enemies on the bridge, so now I'm just sandwiched. In a situation like this, there's really only one thing to do. Okay. I'm fucking for my life right now! I do manage to run away from everybody, and on this little mini-map I'll show you guys how I did it. There you go, that's how I outran everybody. At my current position, I take a reload break and attempt to make my way back to friendly lines, but what ensues is sheer terror. <laughs> oh, f oh, oh shit! As I was leaving my hide position, I was spotted by two enemy trucks filled with enemy troops. They're now, they've now turned their vehicles around and are chasing me up this hill. Oh my god! Why are you hitting me? No. Oh god. There's another truck. Just as I thought I had escaped the two trucks, I look up and there is a tan enemy patrol ahead of me. So I get down really quick and hopefully they don't spot me. Well, operators, I think this is the end. After waiting some time, the patrol does pass by me. I go undetected, so I decide to stand up and kind of search and assess the area, make sure it's all clear for myself to move so I can get the heck out of here. Oh no. These guys are still, these guys are still chasing me. So I take a look back, and to my astonishment, the guys in the truck have now gotten off the truck and are chasing me on foot. I manage to get away from the guys in the truck again, but I come up behind another enemy patrol in the riverbed. These guys look like they're on high alert. I get down and try my best to not make a sound or move too much to alert them to my presence. Just keep going. Keep fucking going. Keep fucking walking. Keep fucking going. Keep walking. Okay, keep walking. Keep walking. Oh my god, keep walking. I'm constantly looking behind me to make sure the guys from the truck don't come up from my rear. Just as the enemy in the creek bed leaves, another enemy patrol arises on the adjacent ridgeline. Oh no. I'm totally surrounded. Got that truck load of guys behind me. Guys up in that ridgeline. And guys down there. Oh my god. There's nowhere to go. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh god. Okay. I'm gonna head back. I'm gonna head back and down. And then around the ridge line that they're on. And just survive this. Well, get this. I did it. Well, half, kind of. I haven't died, and I've made it back to, coincidentally, the campground, which is right over there. But holy sh**, I made it. What do I mean? What do I mean? I made it. I made it. Outran, or lost those guys in the truck. Invaded those two other squads, and now I'm alive. Thanks for watching guys, hope you guys enjoyed the longer video. Once again, this is Jet, Desert Fox, and I'll see you on the field. What's the left? What's the left building?